You know this guy? Tyrone is here, and when Tyrone is here, dressed like this, he's about to make a cocktail because we're getting ready for fat and food. We have St. Mary's in the house Saint this Mary's. morning. Very good. Um, probably, I mean, all, all them college boys and them boosting, but I think St. Mary's, I want to let you them. Do, do say I say what it's, it's always our favorite. Oh, it's always, it's always. It's, it's, yeah. it's, a, it's a big yeah. one. It's yeah. a big one. And this morning, what we're doing, guys, Tyrone is going to whip up a Remy Martin cocktail. Remy Martin. Correct. Remy Martin. Yes. Is going to be showcased at the St. Mary's Fit. Yes, correct. All right. Why Remy Martin? Why? Why you? Because I saw you doing some Remy Martin stuff earlier. Yes. You like Remy um, Martin? Remy Martin is a champagne cognac, as mm. opposed to other cognacs or brandies. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Cognac and brandy is the same thing. Only if it comes from the region cognac, then it has the name cognac. Right. All right. So. Mm. This is a, a Cord Royal, right? And this edition in 1738 is um, King George the Fifteenth, right? Awarded this to okay. Remy Martin Vineyards. Okay. They got a special license to to plant the grapes, mm -hmm. and um, it was a big thing back then because it come like the government giving you land to plant to grapes, plant and, grapes right. right? So, so it, it's a champagne. Yeah. A champagne, champagne cognac, cognac. Yeah. excuse me. Right. Right. What are you doing with it this morning? Well, this has flavors of dark chocolate, butterscotch, right, and some dry fruit notes, right, right. even marmalade. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to start here with some orange peels, right, some dried orange peels. I always like when Tyrone drops by, you smell all the aromatics from here. Yeah, dried orange peel. You want to see orange peel, guys? <laughs> orange dried peel, you know? Yeah, old school. Old school. You always go back. I kind of am a grandmother. I yeah. had to go back to when last I see orange yeah. peel. She would always cut it and hang it up hang by it the up, window, hang it up. dry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. When you get those little gas pains, oh, you know. Oh my goodness, yes, right? yes, so yes. Flashback. On top of this, I'm going to add this beautiful spirit here, Joe. So you're going straight in with your Remy? Yeah, straight in with your Remy onto my orange peels because what happened, I want the, the Remy to now infuse with the orange peels, right? So that's why you're getting this orange nice rich flavor that comes from the oil you make one for you make one for the st mary's boy in the yeah, yeah, yeah 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 uh, yeah are the second yeah, glass yeah, 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 yeah okay yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. right yeah so what i'm gonna do i'm gonna lightly model some of this orange peel right with this remy martin right so essentially the oil is gonna come out and you're gonna get that f infusion you could do this before but i wanted to do a flash infusion i don't want the flavors to be that potent Okay. Right? Flash infusion. Yeah. Mm -hmm. How about how about wait for that? Ooh. Wow. It's beautiful, right? So on top of this, I'm gonna be adding some orange liqueur, which is also a company of Remy Martin. Quantro. Right? So it's Remy Quantro. Right? I I, I could have that what you just mixed there with the orange peel. Yeah. I could have had that on the rocks. You could have had that on the rocks, definitely. That, that yeah. the notes I got there, I I could have I yeah. could have had that on the so rocks. So you get a little yeah. sweet and then maybe a little bitter yeah. to give it a dry mm, note, right? Mm, mm. So after my Remy, I have here Joe, I have here uh, a Tyrone concoction. Yeah. That's yeah. A, that looks yeah. like a Tyrone co co concoction. Well, you know what is my it? company is artistic, so bar concepts. So right. Soon I'm gonna be making some labels for all my signature syrups. Very nice. Right? So what's but that? this one here. It's dark chocolate, our local dark chocolate. You know chocolate has that oily fattiness to it, mm -hmm. right? And then you get that nice, wrong, bitter flavor, right? From the real chocolate, right? So this has a bit of hazelnut as well. So part of the aromas and the flavors that come from this is hazelnut, hazelnut. get that nutty, right? So it's dark chocolate, hazelnut, bay leaf, cinnamon, um, clove, okay. right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So this is gonna be the magic in the cocktail, right? To this, I'm gonna be adding, it's nice and thick. So, let me just take off this. Okay, that's part of the nuttiness. Right. See the well, nuts coming out there? There's actual yeah. nuts there, man. Yeah, yeah, man. Yeah. So, all right. So let me just put that up. And to this now, I'm gonna be adding two large dashes of orange bitters. Orange bitters, yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. Give you that different depth of citrus, mm -hmm, right? Mm -hmm. And I have here some pasteurized egg whites. Pasteurized egg whites. Yeah. I add it in a little lime, so to take away a bit of that freshness. Wow. All right. I'm going to be going with about two ounces of that. This is going to give that Remy Martin a nice thick texture, a nice mouthfeel, and definitely you're going to be getting a nice head of foam on the drink, right? Mm -hmm. Joe, do me a favor. Put the ice, ice up. 
for, you know, for all the sea, sea ice effects. Yes. I just see you with ice, and I use the ice, man. You see with ice? Yeah, I, use, I see you with ice because, I mean, any, any somebody has to bring the ice, you know. So yeah. ice, ice, man? Yeah, somebody has to bring the ice. Are you sure what I'm talking about? <laughs> if you say so. You good, huh? Yeah. You good, huh? Yeah, yeah. All right, right, cool. I am the ice, man. All right, so from here, I'm going to be throwing over this. I'm going to do a wet shake, Joe. All right. I have a name for the shake now, it's called the Trini shake. That's the Trini shake? Yeah. Well, with the egg white in this, I have to give it a good shake, right? I'm telling you, I'll try a little bit of wine, a little bit of wine in that Trini shake. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. A little bit of wine in that Trini shake. For the fat, you'll see it. For the fat, you'll see it. Yeah. Right? For the fat. And you're straining. Yeah. So what I'm doing, I'm going to strain out this now, back into the other tin. Just in color. Yeah. Hazelnutty. Very good. But the scotchy kind of color there. All right. Yeah. So what I want to do now, I want to just give this a nice quick stir. Make sure it's flavor is on point. Wow. You satisfied? Yeah, I'm good. If you satisfied, yeah, I am you, satisfied. It's, it's, Nice. Mm. So from here, Joe, just gonna throw out some, throw out my ice, put my glasses chilling. I'm just gonna pour a little bit cocktail. So you see the nice thick texture of the cocktail has that chocolate unmistakable flavor mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. all right and here now i'm gonna take some chocolate with a hazelnut center and I'm, this is gonna be my garnish all right and i'm gonna take a bay leaf Put them in there. Straight into the drink? Yeah, ma'am. And uh, here I have a dehydrated orange as well, all right? Which has a lot of flavor, all right? That as well, I'm gonna put it on this side. So what happens when the, the drink interacts with the dehydrated orange, it gets back that flavor. So- It rehydrates. Yes, correct. Yeah, that's correct. Right, mm -hmm. so, here we have our drink. I call this one the Remy Royale. The Remy Royale. Yes. Guys, will you be at the Remy Bar at St. Mary's? God willing, I'll be there. You should be there. And I'll be whipping up some really great yeah, cocktails. Yeah, yeah. So, so, so this is the Remy man, the Tyro. Look out for him. And, and these are some of the wonderful cocktails uh, that, that you can get at St. Mary's and so much more. To find out all that we will get, I have a St. Mary's boy in the building. Very good. I have a St. Mary's boy in the building. We're talking fat and food next. I want to thank Tyron for dropping by this morning. I'm going to leave that there because me and the CIC boy will have All a time. Right. All right? Yeah. Come on back. Thanks, Tyron. We will see you when we see you. It's Cup of Joe on TV6.